and welcome Grade 10s to the Graphs and Equations of Motion task video. Let's start with the questions. This graph describes the straight line motion of a car over a period of 60 seconds. Use the graph to calculate the magnitude of the acceleration of the car during the first 20 seconds. Use the graph to calculate the displacement of the car after the 60 seconds. Draw a neat sketch graph of acceleration versus time for the full 60 seconds. Label the axes and show appropriate time and acceleration values. Draw a neat sketch graph of displacement versus time for the full 60 seconds. Label the displacement values at 0, 20, 50 and 60 seconds. An athlete competes in the Commonwealth Games. His average speed is 10,32 meters per second. What is his average speed in kilometers per hour? This is a velocity versus time graph for an athlete's motion during a 100 meter race. The race is divided into three stages, A, B and C. Use the graph to calculate the athlete's acceleration during the first 3,2 seconds. Use one of the equations of motion to calculate the distance that the athlete ran in stage C. Draw the corresponding acceleration versus time graph for the whole of the athlete's motion. The speed limit near a school is 30 kilometers per hour, but Mr. Smith thinks he can ignore it. He drives at 60 kilometers per hour and he is talking on his cell phone. Suddenly, a child runs into the road after a ball. The maximum rate that Mr. Smith can slow down at is 8 meters per second squared. Calculate the distance away from the car the child needs to be in order not to be hurt. We are told that the time it takes for an alert person to react is about 1,5 seconds, while if someone is tired, drunk or distracted by a cell phone, the time it takes for a person to apply brakes can be 3 seconds. Now complete this table. Use the information given to calculate how far away Mr. Smith must be when he first sees the child and applies brakes in order to stop in time. Why do you think it is bad for us to drink and drive or use cell phones when we drive? An aeroplane starts from rest and accelerates at 12 meters per second squared for 8 seconds before it takes off. Calculate the takeoff speed in kilometers per hour. Calculate the minimum length of runway required. Thank you for joining us for this series, Great Tens. If you had any problems with these questions, please watch the other videos in the Graphs and Equations of Motion series for more help or go to our website. Until next time, goodbye.